McCain's disturbing Nazi secret is out days after bashing Trump as Nazi supporter. America's most infamous traitor, John McCain, has been obsessed to take out Trump from the day our new president was sworn into office. We learned recently that McCain was behind the fake Russian dossier against Trump, numerous leaks at the White House, and then successfully killed the Obamacare repeal, becoming the left's instant hero. So predictably, this traitor wasted no time following the Charlottesville incident to spew more of his anti-Trump propaganda, as his obsessive jealousy of Trump continues to rear its ugly head. But unfortunately for McCain, a dark Nazi secret from his past has just surfaced, proving which politician is truly in bed with neo-Nazis. Following the incident over the weekend in Charlottesville where violent members of Antifa communists clashed with white supremacists resulting in the death of one woman, President Trump was very explicit in decrying the actions of both sides. With one Trump supporter who was present at the protest losing his eyesight after having acid thrown in his face by leftists, and numerous reports of other vicious attacks by Antifa members, Trump was correct in his statements that both sides were in the wrong. There was a group on this side, you can call them the left, you've just called them the left, that came violently attacking the other group, Trump said. Then he added, yes, I think there's blame on both sides. You look at both sides, I think there's blame on both sides. I have no doubt about it, and you don't have any doubt about it either. And if you reported it accurately, you would say that. Following Trump's statement, McCain wasted no time twisting the president's comments as proof that Trump supports the KKK and white supremacists, with the following ridiculous statement where he outrageously propped up Antifa terrorists up as the faction who fights hate and bigotry in America. While McCain inaccurately slanders Trump for supporting white supremacists, an unbelievable bombshell McCain's direct ties to actual white terrorists has just surfaced, that will leave you in shock. A breaking bombshell reveals that John McCain is a huge supporter of the neo-Nazi party known as the Svoboda Neo-Nazi Party a terror group that carried out one of the bloodiest coups in Ukraine back in 2013 that McCain helped assist. The Svoboda party also joined Hitler's forces in the 1940s, and single-high-handedly helped Hitler slaughter 200,000 Jews. Neo-Nazis who showed up in Charlottesville over the weekend for the Unite the Right rally are a direct offshoot of the Svoboda party, who we just learned have been donating massive amounts of cash to McCain's institute over the years. Back in 2013, McCain flew to Ukraine and helped these terrorists carry out a coup on their government, where the radical group still donates to McCain's institute as a way of saying thanks. The Business Insider were the ones to discover McCain's ties to these neo-Nazis, exposing how the senator was at the Svovada coup in Ukraine several years ago and was a huge help in overthrowing the Ukrainian president in one of the deadliest coups in history. UK's Channel 4 News revealed how McCain was repeatedly photographed with Olet Heinebach, the leader of the right-wing nationalist party Svoboda, the Business Insider further reported. But that's only the tip of the iceberg of McCain's direct ties to radical neo-Nazis. After working with Obama, Hillary, and this neo-Nazi group to overthrow the elected Ukrainian president and putting a globalist into power, McCain loved hanging out with these neo-Nazis so much that he spent New Year's Eve last year partying with them. And this clown has the freaking audacity to label Trump as a Nazi supporter? It's pretty amazing how McCain is trying to join liberals in their frenzy of labeling Trump a KKK member and a Nazi, when this treasonous posse has been in bed with radical Nazi groups for years, not to mention he's being actively funded by them as they continue to dump millions at his McCain Foundation. Thank you for watching this video. What do you think about this? Share this on Facebook and Twitter along with your comments. comments.